Hi, I'm just going to do some uh, smart targets for this following semester, semester two of year one. Um, so I've got a few goals for this year. Uh, I'm going to say each one individually and uh, try and uh, explain to you why I've chosen this and how easy I feel like it is to achieve these kind of things and stuff. So first of all, the main thing I really want to do this semester is artist development. So I want to kind of... Um, well, develop myself to not get myself heard. So, release material um, that I've already written and things, and just get out there more as a musician personally. Um, I've already busking and stuff, but I want to be gigging and things. Um, I know it's achievable. I've done a few gigs here and there, but I want it to be more of a regular occurrence. And I think within this semester, it's definitely achievable. And that's how I'm measuring it. Is I'm going to be hopefully achieving it within this semester. Um, and I think my next point that follows on from this is songwriting because I mean it, it goes into artist development but I want to improve my songwriting um, and just well just get more songs that I feel confident about um, written basically because I'm writing songs um, I haven't been as productive as of late on writing so it's just I feel like you need to be in a certain mindset for it but um yeah, I've been songwriting for a little while now, and um, there's only a few little like bits, you know, a few like diamonds, I guess you'd say in the in the in the dirt that you feel like you've written and that you're happy with, um, personally anyway. Um, so I'm hoping that I can kind of focus more on myself in terms of artist development, songwriting, um, and be more confident in myself. I think that leads on to the next point as well, which is theory knowledge. I feel like if I have more of a knowledge in theory, that's going to help my songwriting. Because um, uh, my theory knowledge isn't the best, I'm not going to lie. Obviously, um, it can be improved. And I feel like uh, I would like to be able to use my theory of knowledge more in my playing of music, if that makes sense. So... Um, Currently, as a singer, I don't know that much melodically as when it comes to theory. Um, I've always remember, always struggled to remember things. I'm more when I used to play drums, I know a lot more about the theory in terms of neutral clef and playing and reading uh, drums in that sense. But um, when it comes to singing, like looking at where the different notes are and what they are on the stave and stuff and it's just difficult, um, so I need to definitely improve that. Uh, my next point is ear training. I know that was in last semester, but I felt like I became lazy with this one. I had this app on my phone, and I mean, I did use actually things online, and we did do things in within pre-production, but I found I wasn't really interested in it as much. Maybe I should invest more time into it. It's uh, it's a difficult thing ear training because. I don't know if you can really measure how easily when you're getting better, if that makes sense. I don't know how easy it is to measure when you're getting better, when you're improving. But that's definitely something I want to focus on and be making sure that I hear things. Um, and I'm open to see the likes of improvement within the next couple of weeks, really. Like, if I'm really focused on it. I mean, I don't know. I'm going to focus it on point within my practice routine. These points will be within my practice routine. And I think by the end of the semester, I would have hopefully improved all of these. Uh, my improvisation, again, as a drummer, I feel a lot more confident in this. But as a vocalist, I don't. I mean, obviously you've got scatting and stuff, but I would like to be able to just have ro words, melodies roll off my tongue. I mean, melodies isn't so much of an issue, but then finding words there and then... Um, when it comes to singing or things, it just doesn't really go. So I think it's just being more uh, experimental and inventive. When it comes to words and things, I feel like my vocabulary could be extended so I maybe could read more or listen to more ebooks or something. I don't know. Just try and extend my vocabulary and maybe like experiment more with songwriting. And hopefully, if someone's playing something or I'm playing something, I can just. But, you know, oh, here's words, here's a melody, you know, anything. Like Sorry about that. Um, for some reason, I run out of storage, so I just had to delete a couple of videos and apps and things to try and record this video, the rest of it. Um, so, 
my next point is practicing different warm-ups. Uh, last semester I found that uh, I was struggling to find one that really helped and supported me. Um, I think towards the end of the year I realised that I really like these videos um, on YouTube. can't think of the name off the top of my head right now, but there's a YouTuber who has these great warm-up videos that I found quite just easy to use and I don't know, they're very straightforward to get to and didn't have to put, I don't know, I didn't feel like you had to put a lot of time aside and a lot of effort in, it just kind of, you could just kind of do it. Um, I don't know, whereas with an app, I know it sounds really silly, but when I was doing things on this app, I'd have to go through all these different menus and stuff and just got to the point where I was like, I don't know, it sounds really silly and really lazy, but when you can just instantly watch something or do something, it's a lot easier, I find, to stay involved and engaged. Um, and I'm hoping to find one that I really like this week or next week. Uh, I'm going to say next week, within the next, the second week of term. So yeah. And then my next one, last one, is repertoire development. And for this target, I know I feel like it's it's kind of what it says on the tin. I just want to be able to know more songs and feel confident singing different genres. And I feel like last time again was like an example of how I could, you know, sing different songs. I don't think a lot of them sit in my voice personally, um, but it's good to know where you stand, and it's good to know because it was the songs that I didn't. Some of the songs that I didn't expect to feel confident in were the ones that I did feel confident. If that makes sense, and the ones, some of the ones that I did feel feel like I would feel confident, I didn't. But yeah, so uh, that's that's all of them. Again, my video is my phone is running out of storage so it keeps cutting but um i'm gonna cut it there uh, they're my smart targets for this semester and i'm gonna put that into my practice routine so yeah i'm hoping to achieve them all by the end of the semester at least so thank you